I chose CSUN because I needed somewhere where I felt that I would be embraced. It was important to me that I found a community that was supportive and helped me thrive. I first enrolled in CSUN at, in 2014, um, but I experienced uh, a lot of health issues, so I had to take a medical leave. So coming back was difficult. I was nervous and insecure as a student, but I attended Dr. Kim's course, uh, History 271, and that's where I kind of found my way. I struggled with mental illness, and it was something that it took me a while to fully accept and realize I had to take responsibility for, and it wasn't something that was gonna go away. One of the things I really respect about Catherine is that uh, she seems quiet, but she has a ton of courage, and uh, it takes courage to admit to a professor or uh, to someone you don't know well. I came back to CSUN full force knowing that I'd have to take care of that responsibility, but also wanting to thrive as a student. Especially something like mental illness, which has a lot of stigma around it. The more that I get involved in the community at CSUN, the happier I became. I became a university ambassador where I got to give tours once a week to show prospective students the things I loved about CSUN. It was important for me to not only become a university ambassador, but then you know, get involved in the English Honor Society and become a treasurer there. And I just became so much more involved, which in turn made me a better student, but also a happier one. You know, whenever we would talk about Brown versus the Board of Education or other landmark court cases, I could kind of see you perk up. Whenever you saw people being able to put the law to use mm -hmm. to create a better world, uh, you were, I, I could see that like, shaping not only how you saw the world, but what you wanted to do and your place in it. I actually applied to a couple of law schools and I'll be attending law school this fall. And I plan on being an attorney who uses my empathic connections with people to help teach them how to become advocates for themselves.